Look like at the trailer, horse trailer hooked up. We're getting a special surprise. And you're going to see it first before Gabby and Sophie. Hey guys, welcome to a brand new day. Every single day holds the possibility of a miracle. The only thing you need to do is get up and start each day and see how it unfolds. It might not be today, it might not be tomorrow, but every day holds the possibility of changes and bringing you closer to your dreams come true. So get up, start today, and see where today takes you. So we are going to start giving Willow some vitamin supplement too. I'm going to possibly wean her off her own grain at some point and just put her on the vitamin supplement because, um, yeah, because that's what we're going to do. <laughs> Got no, it is way too early. That's the thing about barn chores. They happen before coffee kicks in. Right, Gabby is. Easy, get up at 5 a.m. Yeah, easy, get up at 5 a.m. Yep, yep. Have you gone in to see them yet? Yeah. Okay, I don't want to go in there before. Oh, Willow likes her salt lick. Can you hold it? Yeah, we need to get, we have a bunch of things to get. Poor little Willow needs a salt lick today. I'll get her the mineral one. Oh, hello. Hello. So. I want to just tell you guys, our barn does not smell like a barn yet. It smells good still. Huh. Hello. Hello, pretty girl. She wants her breakfast. So she is getting hungry by breakfast time, aren't you? Because usually, she's like so good though, you guys. She's like, give it to me now. Slow poke Gabby. I did it in a swirl. <laughs> Cute. Yeah. I don't know what's wrong with our horses. I was telling somebody last night that we put their food outside. First we give them hay in their stalls in the morning because I want to make sure that Willow gets enough that she needs. Uh, then we put the rest of it outside in the paddock. And No, I gotta empty that. We need to do it then. Um, yeah, so I do that and then the minute their hay is gone, they go inside. And I'm like, what the heck? Why? What? What's wrong with our horses? Like. I thought horses want to be outside in the fresh air and see everything. They don't. They stay inside the arena almost all the time. It's insane. Willow is definitely really bonded to Stella. I mean, it's a new place. She's not bonded to us yet, really. And she's a bit nervous. She wants to always be with Stella. Stella doesn't seem to care. She'll go wherever the food is. Um, and you guys, like... All that bonding we did with Stella before, like all that bonding, trying to get her to come to us and stuff, she, she it was so worth it. She's amazing. Like she looks for us, she, like she's more bonded to us than she is to Willow, and she, yeah, it's been super amazing. She's been super amazing. We are here at the horse farm, and I see a lot of foot push for hoof prints. Anyway, it's a gorgeous, beautiful, warm day. And we're meeting friends. Do you guys remember those Pasofino riders that we met here before? I think they are here today and we came to ride with them. We don't know if we're gonna ride Storm because- I'll bareback him around. She might just walk him. Because he had a little rub mark on the back of his foot and we don't, we wanna make sure he feels good first. Tex, hey. Tex. Tex. They're like, stop bothering me. See if he comes to you. So we're meeting Kaylee here, so we decided we'd get text for her, because she got storm for us last time. Oh gosh. 
Uh oh. Grab his blanket. <laughs> he hates us today. Storm is partaking of the buffet. Good boy. All right, you guys, we are here at the barn and we have a little tiny group with us. You guys might remember Madison from, or Maddie from uh, Gabby's types of equestrian video. We got Gabby over there cleaning Storm's little scratch. We got, uh, shoot, what's your name again? <laughs> Kaylee and Tex. And we have another Madison. And you guys might remember her because she has a YouTube channel called Paso Fever. And she rode here, right? Yep. And that is her horse. Okay, comment below you guys. What is the name of this horse if you guys know? Sophie's been in love with him. Um, so we had some drama before we left today to get to the barn. What happened? I hurt my wrist. She falling. fell right on her wrist and so there's that drama. That's enough of the drama for today, right? This is gonna be a good day, everybody. So we brought um, warm water and a little uh, I'm thermos and our little sponge. <laughs> She's gonna do what the farrier does. Good boy. I remember Gabby. He actually, yeah, he actually, if it hurts him. So, anyways, I don't know if he. Oh, it looks 500% better already. Yeah. Yeah, so basically you just had a scratch. But you know what's weird? How God works in mysterious ways. I literally started reading about scratches. And then we came and Storm had a scratch. So we have some cream to put on it too. Some antibiotic cream. But he looks good. You're such a good pony. Yes, you are. Look at the trailer. Horse trailer hooked up. We're getting a special surprise. And you're going to see it first before Gabby and Sophie. We got all the horses out there. Door. Follow the leader. So Storm's already feeling a lot better now that he's had cream. On Kaylee's up. Oh my gosh, look at her go. I f I'm feeling like there's gonna be a pony swap going on here today. She wants somebody to ride her. She's been offering everybody to ride her Paso. Yeah, poor Storm has to just walk. So we're just walking Storm even though he looks like he's in a fast mood today. He's been stepping out so nicely. One crazy thing about Tex is that if you just let him go where he wants to go, he goes straight to the jumps. He's like, oh, I'm jumping. Yeah, he's got springs. That horse has actual springs on him. Right, so I don't know if you guys can see one of these things is not as it usually is. It's definitely not. <laughs> I actually want somebody else to jump storm one day when he's when his leg is better. So not only is she on another horse, but she is bareback on a strange horse. And bitless. I know, 
you look really long on that horse. Like, yeah, her legs are really like long. Madison. Whoa, was that a spook? A trip? It looked like a, it sounded like a scoot. Um, Madison, Gabby looks like longer, looks taller on that horse than you. Look at his ear straight forward. He's like, what the heck was that? I said, no, it's not gonna happen. Is this smooth? First time ever riding a gated horse. Oh Storm's like, what the heck? What is she doing on him? Storm's like, don't trade me in. Storm, you're never being traded in. Good job, Gabby. Kaylee, you need to ride him. Yeah, Kaylee's next. Well, that's a nice ride, right? Yeah. You don't even need to use your size on him, Kaylee. <gasps> what do you think? And you're so little, and you find him bony. He's so oh, he is narrow. Love you you got to do the trot test. Kansas. <laughs> Do you want to get off and give Kaylee Storm? Wow, he looks flashy. So are those his bumper boots? His traveling boots? Yeah, that's what she Oh, so it's... Oh, okay. That's probably more comfortable. It's blue. That blue looks nice on him. So Gabby, why don't you let Kaylee ride him for a minute and we'll take Little out and get his wraps and blanket changed and okay? I'll get all this stuff in the truck and I guess. Yeah, we'll need his blanket. Look at how much they look alike though. That's our horse. <laughs> don't they look so much alike? Oh <laughs> and he's a quarter horse. Really? Yeah. He's a quarter horse that looks like a thoroughbred. And probably he's got three white and he's got three black. Not expect this, so he says. <laughs> I did. You expected it? <laughs> hey, Uncle Dad, get the trailer to go to Fiona. I told you, Fiona needed to use it. Right it's not the first time he's done this to us. We <laughs> <laughs> did it with Storm, and now we're through. So I brought some halters. Do we have extra halters in our uh, locker? Or I brought some in the car. Okay, you guys, I don't know if you caught it, but we 
surprise their kids with a new horse. Um, don't get excited and don't get crazy because there's a lot of things that you guys don't know about this horse. There's a lot of things you don't know. Like you guys are gonna be so proud of us when you find out all the details of this new horse. Um, I learned a few things. Yeah, I, but he is super lazy. I just wait, so I learned quite a few things about horses and about buying horses and about getting horses for our kids over the course of this last couple of horses that we bought. So anyway, um, I'm going to make another video. It'll probably be up tomorrow, tonight maybe, um, all about our new horse. And you guys are going to get to know all the details. So don't freak out about any of the details until you know the details. But anyway, that is it. We're going to see you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.